saint. Righteous ponage. Greetings to thee, Arc Saint here. By God's grace, I was able to make a physical edition of my game All That Remains. If you remember a while back, I uploaded that for Tabletop Simulator. Uh, you can go back and check that out if you want. But uh, I, I used um, the Game Crafter, which is a really awesome site and company. So anybody that has a game idea can go on here and put it together as long as you have the assets. And you can order a physical copy, which I think is it's really awesome. You should definitely give it a look. The only downside to the Game Crafter is all the games are really expensive because they're not mass produced. So you could order you could order just one copy of your game. You don't have to order like a hundred and they'll send you that one copy. Which is really, really cool. So anyhow, I put all that remains into their system and got it all worked out and I was able to get the physical copy to where you can you can actually buy it. So if you actually want to own a physical copy of all that remains, you can Follow the link in the description and come to this website. Again, it's expensive. <laughs> uh, right now, uh, as far as this video goes, <clears throat> at the time of this video, it's, it's $87.99, which is quite a lot. But uh, it is available if you, if you want to get it. I, I have my own copy. Um, this is a store page, uh, obviously. And <clears throat> this video here, because you can try it before you buy it, is just my video of can earn um, of the, the tabletop simulator edition. So, um, and it, it does look the final version does look a little bit different uh, with the cards and everything. I'll I'll show you down here if I can get to. There we go. This is actually on my kitchen table, but. Um, and get this static. There we go. The the final version. I paid an artist to do the space artwork and for the background. It just looks way nicer than, than what I had before. And I also have the rights to use it. Everything else I drew myself. I also uh, use this artwork for the cover. I think it it fits the the theme of the game, which you're throwing your 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 works into a a bonfire essentially. But yeah, you get the cards, you get these unique dice, um, gold, silver, precious stones, good intention tokens, all these mats you can play up to six players. And, uh, oh, except for the, the, the holder with the cards uh, is, is no longer being sold on the website, unfortunately. So you pretty much get everything here except for the card holder. But um, yeah. Then you can see the game in action. Do, do, do. Pretty nice. I thought the quality was pretty decent, uh, especially the cards. Uh, the cards turned out really nice as well. That's the back of the box. Um, so really excited for that. Uh, this was actually released in November 2022, so pretty late on making a video about this <laughs> but uh, yeah if anybody would like to play a game based on the judgment seat of Christ I don't think there's another game like this uh, if there is let me know because I'd be interested but uh, as, as far as Christian themed games go I don't think anybody's ever made a game about the judgment seat of Christ uh, so really really happy with how it turned out and the uh, Again, I don't expect anybody to buy it with the price tag, but if you, if you want to, uh, give her, let me know what you think. Uh, but you, you can't just play it for free if you have Tabletop Simulator. You just go on the um, uh, Steam Workshop and you can give it a go. But yeah, uh, glory to God. I'm really, really happy how this uh, turned out, how it looked. So yeah, all right. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, until next time, may the Lord be with thee.